Hey friends, welcome back to my video. It's been a hot minute since I've recorded anything. When creative blocks happen, they happen real hard. Um, in this video, I am going to do a little review on the Soon, Soonto, I think that's how you say it, on the Soonto Fitness Watch, Soonto 3 Fitness. So, if you want to know about my new fitness watch and if I like it and what it does, then please keep on watching. I'll just show you what it looks like. First, all my fuzz is on the wrist band from my sweater. Let me just clamp it off. But that is the watch there. It's really pretty. So that's obviously where your heart rate is monitored and all that jazz. This is where you charge it. Um, I got to choose between the colors. So they asked if I wanted the all black or um, I think there's a couple other colors, but I really wanted to try the white and the gold. Um, I'm always interested with like white wristbands only because I want to see how quickly and if it does get super dirty. Um, so that's what it looks like. Three buttons on one side and two buttons on the other side to navigate everything. So on the package, this is what it looks like. That's how I got it in a box. And on the front there, it says Adaptive training guidance, activity tracking, sleep quality, and tracking. On the back, it also has extra stuff for you to know. There's fitness level, heart rate zones, multiple sport modes, wrist heart rate, connected GPS, and it's 30, it's water resistant under or for 30 meters. Seven day training plan that adapts to you. Also haven't tried that yet. Um, call, text, and notifications to watch. That is so cool. Okay, so when I opened it up, I could have done an unboxing video, but I was leaving my house when I got it, and I really couldn't wait, so <laughs> um, that's out. In the actual box, I got this like handkerchief thing. It's like, str oh, <laughs> it's not stretchy. <laughs> Not that way at least. Stretchy this way. If anyone watches Survivor and you know how they give them their like little handkerchief thingies or whatever this is, that's a Survivor on it and you can literally wear it like any way you can possible. Arr. That is what the app looks like. Um, but I'm going to do a come on there, come on there. Yeah, Doug. Okay, there we go. But I'm gonna um, record my screen and kind of go through everything with you. You can choose to change how this looks if you like the. This is analog, right? Yeah, I always forget this. The one that looks more like a, a clock you can put on this button here basically just is like a back button. Um, the middle button here is to select and then the bottom and the top are to go up and down. So if you press the side button, it just takes you through the date um, and how much battery you have left. So that's pretty cool. Oh, okay, there we go. That's how you get to it. Okay, so if you go to the, oh, it's kind of dirty, oopsies. If you um, click the middle button and then click the bottom button, these are all of the things that have come up like on Facebook. These are a bunch of podcasts that I have that like pop up on my on my phone. So that's pretty cool. I mean, and then you can click them and just like read more and it just takes you back. Um, so we'll go all the way back and let's see. Okay, that's it. 
So go to the front, and this here is the main page pretty much. If you hold down the middle button, it brings you like, so it doesn't beep or make any noises. You can press do not disturb, you can have alarms, um, you can click when the sun rises and put the actual time that it rises at, but we'll go back. I'm not gonna do that, cause I'm gonna wake up at the sunrise, you know what I mean? Um, you can click your timer, set your timer, and you can change your watch face. Um, right now, I think that one's mine, and you can, like this one looks dope. And make sure that we've gone through everything. So if you go to settings, um, it has your alarms, your connectivity, your activity, um, it tells you your daily heart rate. Um, use wrist heart rate for 24-7 tracking. Um, target tells me my target steps and I can also change them, but we'll keep it at that. Um, and then I want to burn a total of 2,000 calories a day. And then notifications about activity targets are turned on. So that's pretty cool. I really hope you can see it. Um, and then let's go down to training. So, yeah, there's the adaptive training guidance. Um, I guess you can turn it on. Um, I don't really know for sure like what that does. My weekly goal for training is 11 hours. Advanced zones for specific zones. So let's see, oh, okay, so I don't run and I don't cycle. Let's go back. Um, okay, cool. Okay, so sleep tracking. That's cool. So I want to try and get eight hours of sleep a night. And you can put like when you want to go to bed and what your sleep target is. So mine is eight hours. And then auto do not disturb. Um, so I guess when you go to sleep. And exercise. This one's really cool. Um, I guess that's just like hit training, like hit interval training, running, uh, cycling, walking, pool swimming, indoor training. So I would probably choose that. And then you can go to other and it's literally like going with all these activities. Like how's that cool is that? Cheerleading, what? Badminton, table tennis, squash. Like, I can't. Oh, cross trainer. Horseback riding. Like, it just keeps going. So, I thought that's my favorite part. And I think that's like this re a really good intention for this watch is like this covers all fitness activities. Um, I think that's really cool. That is a tour of this watch. And we've got your lights here. That's obviously like, yo fam, put me back on your arm. I thought that was a really cool opportunity to try out this new watch. And I can put the link on where to get it, where to get more information on it um, in the description below. I'm really excited to keep, you know, figuring out cool things about this thing and working out with it and seeing how accurate things are. But um, I'm going to actually do one more tour another one um, and that's just gonna be through the app. this means I've reached a certain training goal. I'm still trying to figure out how to use this <laughs> you can go to see how many steps um, you're currently at and then you can you are able to adjust your goal, um, how many calories you currently are burning or have burned. Oh, total of 63 kcals. Come on, I've been moving more than that. I got six hours and 39 minutes of sleep last night. That's like pretty decent. Um, so you can also adjust it there too. And this is kind of like your little diary which is kind of cool. Um, you can add pictures. So yesterday I um, did some weight training or resistance training, if you will. And um, you can choose who sees it, 
maybe we'll just go private. Um, how long it was, when it was, how many calories you burned. Um, so that's really cool. And what else? <laughs> so yeah, like I said yesterday, worked out for a couple hours. And uh, what else here? Oh, it shows me kind of my steps throughout the week, daily average. And you believe I'm going to boost that up because... We're, this watch is new to the game. And then daily average calories burned, 1,500. Come on. No. Oh, okay. Uh, daily average. So yesterday was 1,525. And today was 864. And then it only slept with it on my wrist once. So obviously it has only one... Um, one thing you track there. Um, oh, 44% quality of sleep. Oops. Um, and leaderboard, I guess you can, oh, you can um, find friends who have the same watch as you and kind of like challenge them to certain things. And this is really cool if you're an outdoor runner, um, you can track like where you are running to and then your profile. Um, that's me. I haven't really added anything. I only have one activity. I would highly recommend this watch for anyone who is interested in any kind of fitness watch. Like, I already love it. I think it looks really cute too. Like, it just... But when I want to look cute and go on a date with Bay, and I can wear my watch um, and not think it looks like too sporty, um, that's always good. So, thank you so much for watching. I hope I kind of covered everything for you. Um, if you want to know where to get this watch, I'm going to put it in the description box below. If you have any more questions, um, please comment below. And remember to subscribe, like, and comment all the things and share. Because I love you and I love when you do that. And I'm glad I made a video. And we're here. Okay, college girl.